Have you ever just taken a seat and wondered why you love a series so much that you ended up actually writing an idea for a video you didn't plan at all from the start? Yeah, this is that video, and these are my top 10 Bleach Confessions that will end up being 11 because I feel like it. Number one, my friends and I from high school used to sing the first ending theme together on bus rides on the way home from school. And when we got together again, we tend to sing this in opening one as a sort of sign of our friendship. Number two, episode nine is the episode that made Ichigo my favorite character for nearly nine years, recently being surpassed by Sakata Gintoki from the series Gintama. Number three. My most rewatched and reread scene in anime and manga is episode 58 slash chapter 162, where Ichigo first unleashes his Bankai against Byakuya. That was, and probably still is, my favorite transformation of all time. Number four, I thought that Gin was the killer in the Soul Society arc, leading him to become my favorite character throughout the arc. I absolutely loved how I thought he put every, everything on everyone else, man. Making everyone absolutely restless against one another, taking advantage of the situation at hand with a Ryoka invading, but no! Instead it was Aizen! <coughs> Aizen! And one of the craziest Aizen plot twists I have ever seen. Aizen! I love Bleach Filler, and I mean I love Bleach Filler. Throughout my years of watching the anime weekly on both Adult Swim and through the Subversion, I would love watching the fillers because they not only gave me a chance to see my favorite characters in real life situations, or maybe characters that aren't featured as often, such as the Karakurizer episodes, but it also gave me an opportunity to witness something brand new that I hadn't already read in the manga. Number 6, I only missed one week of watching Bleach in my entire lifetime of watching an Adult Swim, and that was episode 295, which I had to miss due to being on my first ever cruise trip with my family. Other than that, my butt would make sure to be home every Saturday night on either 12.30, 1 o'clock, 1.32, or 12 o'clock, or maybe all of the above, to catch the latest episode or even reruns of that Bleach Awesome sauce. Oh. And of course the short weeknight run it had in 2007, but being sleepy in first period, it was worth it. Number 7, my favorite version of Haruka Kanata is version 7. Even though my favorite arc in the series is the Soul Society arc, my, my highest peaks as a Bleach fanboy were from episodes 110 to 167 and the beginning portion of the Thousand Year Blood War. Openings 5, 6, and 7 sure hit home every time I listen to them. I used to search up the term Bleach on Twitter from episode 212 up until the finale, episode 366, to see what other people were saying about what was happening in the series. Yes, I was obsessed, but being a Bleach nerd felt so good. Number 9, I used to have a theory that Aizen was Ichigo's mother, don't question it, don't think about it, just remember that theories back then were very, and I mean very, out there. Number 10, Bleach Memories of Nobody is my favorite of the four Bleach films. Even though I have watched Fade to Black and Hellverse more times, it's just Senna, man. Freaking love Senna. The character interaction between her and Ichigo actually made me wish she was a part of the main cast. And that ending is an ending that has still stuck with me all of these years later. And finally, number 11, from the very beginning of my YouTube channel up until now, the Bleach community has supported me and has been on my side throughout this journey of the awesome sauce and just as the goal is never really the true goal, it is instead the journey. You guys have made this journey of following Bleach with me 100 times better than I could have ever imagined and for that I really do thank you guys from the bottom of my heart. I've met so many awesome people and the Bleach community is truly awesome so thank you very much for allowing me to be a part of something so special. And this has been my top 10 slash 11 Bleach reconfessions that I just felt like making. Have an awesome sauce of a day. On the next installment of that awesome sauce, we tackle Metal Gear Rising Revengeance for the first time in quite a while, while we talk about topics such as the new Call of Duty remaster and Nintendo's new business moves. I'll see you there.